Well, we're out here again uh, on the water at Anderson's Inlet. Uh, have a bit more of a closer look at this um, well talked about 605 console. This particular boat's been nicknamed the Elite. Um, reasons being, it's a, been a bit of a concept boat that Extreme have put together to really show you what they're capable of and, and what they're all about. Uh, this boat got entered into the Auckland Boat Show Awards, not only taking out its own category, but the overall boat of the show. So. We'll have a closer look at a few of the finer details to show you what they're all about. I guess functionality is uh, a key point and very important to, to most boaties. Uh, we've got large fascia mounting areas. We've got two nine inch Raymarine units fitted to this boat. VHF radio, we've got our trim tabs We've got fusion stereo, again controls, winch controls, steering. So everything's at the ready and at the helm uh, in easy, easy reach. Something that's a little bit unique to Extreme at the moment um, is this new digital switching that they've incorporated through their higher level of fit outs. Um, you can see here we've got a series of switches which we can control the battery switch off and on. Uh, we've got night anchorage which fires up our nav lights. Uh, I've got fishing modes, um, basically fire it up, you hear there our pumps fire up, our deck wash pump switches on, everything's ready to go. With the Targa frame they've gone to a billet style. It's CNC cut out of a solid 35mm bit of plate alloy, which allows them to check it in around the console, therefore gaining space. Something you consistently see throughout Extreme's design is functionality. The console's a great example again of that. Not only do we have a, a wide console to mount our electronics, we still have a, a wide walkway. They've managed to incorporate a stepped in gunnel, which keeps our entry point quite wide, therefore making it easy to, to commute through to the front of the boat. The complete extreme console range all incorporate this raised casting platform. It really maximises the amount of deck space that carries forward in the boat. Again, with space in mind, Extreme have incorporated a bolstered style seat. Um, so whether you're standing at the driving position or wanted to have a seat, you've got the best of both worlds. A great example of um, this Elite series uh, is basically just this, this set of module. Uh, incorporates a heap of cool features. Um, we've got an alloy moulded sink, not a drop-in. Nice little prep area, as you can see we've got a light there for that night fishing if you're preparing your bait etc. Um, storage drawers, uh, a couple there, beautiful little soft close hinges. Uh, we all get hungry out in the boat, so we've got a beautiful little cooker in there. And down the bottom we've got a larger drawer there which incorporates our esky. Again, an example of extreme uh, taking things to the elite level. Um, our sink incorporates both fresh and salt water mixing taps. So with our endless supply of salt, you can run that all day. Otherwise, if you're washing your hands, ready to have a feed or something, you can switch to fresh. Um, you've got a 60 litre freshwater tank on board this particular boat. Obviously, you know, the console range is a great fishing boat, whether you um, do your trips up north, chasing you know, your barra up in the creeks and estuaries, or even down here chasing our, um, I guess, our southern barra. Extreme about making boating easy, matching this elite console with the auto-deploying Minn Kota, um, just really makes fishing a breeze. Launch. Anchor lock, and we're fishing. I tell you what, what an awesome mix of features this boat has. Uh, whether we're fishing offshore, we've got tuna tubes, we've got outriggers on board. Um, as we're here today, up in the estuaries, we've got raised casting platform, min coders on board. It's, it's really a, an outfit that's pretty hard to improve on.
One of the most important things in a boat is obviously storage. Um, Extreme have managed to incorporate quite a large area within their console. Um, this particular boat actually has a toilet situated underneath the, set, the seat. We've got a dive tank holder there if people are out diving. Storage which goes further under this forward floor as well. The console boats are generally targeted to um, the serious fishos, um, who of course carry a serious amount of rods. Um, front wishbone rod storage is very popular, um, keeping our, um, our rods out of harm's way. Got a series of four vertical mount rod holders across the bow. Running down the side of the console again, we've got three vertical mounted rod holders. As you'd expect, a series of overhead rod holders through our targa. The gunnel mounted rod holders again are an example of Extreme's quality. As we mentioned before, CNC cut and fully welded. Our bait ball consists of a series of four rod holders across the back. We've got a good uh, prep area uh, and of course as you can see storage drawers across the front and something that not a lot of manufacturers have. We've got a uh, water skiing tow point that uh, allows you to tow off the back of it as well. A great little accessory uh, are these flush cleats. So keeps our deck clean and clear, uh, but still incorporating cleats throughout the boat. Down the transom end of the boat, uh, we incorporate, of course, our tuna tubes. We've got our bait board assembly. We've got our live bait tank, which is generous in size clear window in the front to keep an eye on what's happening inside. We've got large access hatches into our battery storage area. We've got a burly bucket mounted off the rear swim step. Like all extremes, we've got a walk-through transom with a drop-in door. Extreme give you the choice of having either a drum or a capstan style anchor winch as is fitted to this boat. We've got great access in. Um, in the unlikely event, as I always like to say, of a rope jam, or if we have a drum style, the drum winch is fully concealed within the anchor well, not protruding out through the front. Well, thanks for taking the time to have a look through this 605 Elite Center Console. As mentioned, Extreme have got a full range of consoles, right from the 545 through to the uh, Mighty 745. So whether it's a day out off the shelf, chasing your pelagic fish, or a trip up the estuaries, um, I'm sure there's a, a combination um, and size there to suit. Well, if you've enjoyed the uh, Extreme videos and pretty keen to see a bit more, Either hit the subscribe button below or jump on inverlockmarine.com.au.